Hi, come on in. You must be my one o'clock appointment? Perfect. You can have a seat. And I was just taking a few notes before we get started. So you're here for a custom measuring appointment, correct? Wonderful. And what is the occasion? A masquerade ball. Very nice. Well, I'm happy to help you out today. So just a few questions. Will you be getting a custom mask created? Okay. So then I will measure parts of your face as well. And then is there a certain type of fabric that you would like for your shirt? Okay. And are you doing pants as well? Full costume? Okay. Perfect. And any specific color? Okay. Perfect. And then what color were you thinking for the mask? And then any special design on the mask, so some people will put jewels, some people will put feathers, it's really up to you. Jewels? Okay. Any specific color? Pink? Perfect. Yeah, we do have a nice selection of pink ones. Now let me just take down your phone number again. Perfect. And then your email. And then when do you need everything by? Yeah, we can do that. If you would have came any later, it might have been a stretch, but we'll be fine with that. So, perfect. So I'll be taking your detailed measurements, and really all I need you to do is stay still for me. The first thing I'm going to do is just do a quick sketch for your body type. So let me get my pencil and notepad. Just standing up for me. And you can just stand right in front here. And then I'm just going to start with the sketch. And again, this is just for my reference when I start making the outfit for you. So just stay still. Your hair. Perfect. 
turn a little bit to the side shoulders back for me just one more part okay. all right perfect so that is all I need for the sketch and now we can get started with the measurement just checking my measurement list here. I'm gonna start with your eyes. And I need you to stay very still for this. Since we'll be creating a mask for the ball, I want to make sure I get these measurements 100% accurate so that it fits perfectly. So, first, going to measure the width and the height of both of your eyes and then the bridge of your nose and then your eye to your hairline and of course I'll get the circumference of your face for the mask as well First thing is your eyes, so just come a little bit closer, good, and I'm going to start with your left eye, so just stay still for me, and looks like about an inch, and Now I'm going to get the height. Just keep looking straight ahead. Perfect. Okay. Let me check the side. Typically they're the same, so it should be simple. Start with the height. Just get the bridge of your nose. Yep, just continue to stay still. Perfect. And then left side. Your eye to Just measure the full length of your face, top to bottom. Let's see. Looks like about eight, five, about seven and a half, eight. Okay. And now the circumference. 
circumference of your head, like so. Just stay still again. A lot of staying still for this. And I'm just gonna wrap this around. your forehead from side to side. So, can you just lift your hair a little bit for me? Perfect. And get it right there. So, about seven. for your face, your hairline to your eyebrows. So, just lift your hair again for me. Okay, right now, do you need a break? Do you need water? Okay, just let me know if that changes. I know it gets kind of hot in here, so just let me know. All right, so now moving on to the body. Let me first do your chin to shoulder. And then, then I'll do the circumference of your neck. So first let's do chin to shoulders. It should be the same on both sides, but I just double check. For this one, chin to shoulders. About Let's just check this side. Again, it should be the same. Looks like five point five point two. Good. And now the circumference of your neck. Can you just lift your hair off of your neck, please? Go around again. And let's see. Looks like about 13 inches. Neck. Circumference. And then chin. Is your chest. So I'm gonna need you to lift your arms and I'm gonna wrap this around your chest. Very good. Okay. Perfect. Yep, just stand up tall. Good. And now put 
put your arms down to your side. Yeah, I'm gonna get it with your arms as well. to do your arms. So, let's start with the left one here. And just stand up tall. I'm going to measure from the top of your shoulder to your wrist. Okay, so this is obviously for your shirt. your left wrist. So can you just put your hand out for me? I'm just going to wrap this around. And let's see. Oh, eight inches. So left arm. Left wrist. Are you having gloves made? No. Okay. I was gonna say, I didn't think you asked for a hand measuring, but we do offer that as well. So let's do your right arm. Same thing. Shoulders back. Arm at your side. And let's just get this measurement. Get your waist. So, for your waist, I just need you to again stand up tall and lift your arms at your side. Get waist, and this will be for your pants. It's 31, but let me just double check. I like to sometimes measure at different angles to make sure. Yep. That looks to be right. to do. Yeah, let me get this as well. But I'll just get a quick measurement of your ears. I did forget that. Just because that will be important to have. 
for the mask we'll be creating for you. So can you just turn your head? Get the width here. So two point three, two point four. Okay, and the height. So three point three, three point four. Okay, and now look the other way. here and right here same size and I'm assuming you just want the typical string for the mask or would you like more of a ribbon? ribbon black as well? yeah, that'll look really nice so black So now I need you to step up on the platform here. I'm going to be measuring your out seam. So the top of your waistband to the ground. Your inseam, which is the inside of your seam to the ground. And your ankles. What kind of shoes will you be wearing out of curiosity? Dress shoes? Okay. Sounds good. We'll do the out seam first. Just stay very tall for me. Shoulders back. Yep, and then just stand very straight. Good. Okay. Perfect. And let's do this side. Seam. Now just two more things. I want to get your ankles. So if you can just lift your pant legs up a little bit. Perfect. And let's do them both at the same time here. So it looks like inches and eight inches so that just leaves one more measurement and it's your full height so I'm just gonna measure from the top of your head to the bottom of your feet. So I'm just going to put this at the top of your head. Very 
very good. And can you just hold it up there for me? <laughs> Thank you. And I'm gonna have this go all the way to the bottom. So we can see your height. Okay, perfect. So it looks to be about five foot. Very good. I must say, this was one of the easiest measurements I've ever had. Like I said, you did a fantastic job. So next steps, I'm going to get working on the outfit for you. And what I'll do is send a kind of sketch to your email before I actually create it. I just want to make sure the design is exactly what you're looking for. Not only with the outfit, but also with the mask. Alright? And don't be afraid to tell me if you want any changes done. That's what I'm here for. I'm anticipating this to take about two weeks in total. If you have changes, it might be a little bit longer, but we do have all the fabric in stock for what you chose, which is great. And if we have any trouble with anything, we'll let you know. We might have to have you pop back in, but since I have all the measurements, it really should be simple. So, do you have any questions for me? Any concerns? Anything else? Alright. Well, that's it then. I don't need payment right now. You'll pay when you pick up. And like I said, I'll keep you updated via email or give you a call. Okay? Perfect. Well, thank you for coming in. Thanks for giving us your business today, and I'm looking forward to creating everything for the ball. So, take care, and I'll be in touch soon.